Supporters say the Oakley Carlson Act will save lives, but it's not expected to pass this session. Still, that is not keeping Oakley's former foster mother from fighting for it. She and other supporters rallied here at the Capitol last week, and this morning they lined up to testify in favor of the bill. They say the state let Oakley down. The proposed law would create stricter requirements for parents to regain custody and would require casework supervision for a minimum of five years before closing a case. Currently, that lasts six months. The Oakley Carlson Act would allow the court to call for continued intervention if there is evidence of drug use or other criminal activity. Oakley's former foster mother kicked off the public testimony this morning. After Oakley was returned to her bios to what would be a literal hell on earth for her, I called twice with concerns of abuse. I had heard that Oakley looked sickly and saw a photo where she had dark circles under her eyes and possibly a black eye. The chair of that committee, Representative Tana Sen, says she is open to making improvements in Oakley's name, but says this bill is not, quote, implementable or effective. It was expected to die in that committee this morning, but Representative Jim Walsh, the Republican behind the Oakley Carlson Act, says he's going to try to see if it can pass through another committee, which extends that deadline another week. In Olympia, Drew Mickelson, King 5 News.